Hey guys, it's Jess. So I just wanted to do a really super quick haul for you guys. It's more of a beauty um, haul. So let's just get started. I picked up these three products from Walmart last night. I'm getting a little bit older. My birthday is next week. I'll be turning 37. I'm excited, you know, I'm aging. It's good, right? But now I just think it's time to do a little bit more um, skincare. I've always been, you know, washing, moisturizing, priming, and all that stuff before makeup. But now it's a little bit just um, when I'm just home, when I'm waking up in the morning, going to bed, I, I just figured I'd need a little bit something more. Um, so I'm starting with this rock, um, Max Resurfacing Facial Cleanser. It's like a light scrub. Then this is the Equate Beauty line. It's right next to rock. You know how like Walmart, Target, they all do that, right? So this is the uh, Wrinkle Correcting Serum. This is reduces the... The reduces the appearance of deep wrinkles. This is a serum, so I'm thinking I can put them, use them both, and that's why I picked up the Neutrogena Anti Wrinkle Deep Wrinkle Night Moisturizer, more for night, I guess. So day and night. Okay, we'll see what happens. Okay, these were um, impulse buys <laughs> and packaging, packaging and presentation suckered me in. I thought this Echo Tools one looked amazing. I love the colors on the barrel. Um, it just looks really cute. The, and it says for eye perfecting, um, and it says used for creams and moisturizers and concealers. I use the 130 right now from MAC, or I use, um, I primarily use that one, or a brush very similar to like a 217, or an actual 217 or a 275 which is like an angled brush all those are mac ones um so this one is around it's about as big as a 130 but it has a dome shape whereas the 130 is flat it looks like it also is a dual fiber brush i'll just bring it a little bit closer and that's pretty big i don't know why it's not focusing so it's pretty big, it's not flat, it's nice. I'm excited to try that. This is the flower line from um, Drew Barrymore. And I have not tried any of their stuff before, but I just loved how this is shaped. I'm gonna turn it. See how it's kind of like edged out and it's really cool looking. It's like a rose gold farrel. Oh, I said barrel, I meant to say farrel. Um, it's really nice. I'm excited about it. It was just an impulse buy. I like how it looked, and there we go. Okay, the next item, I am in love with MAC eyeshadows. I really am. I have a ton of them. I use them all the time. But sometimes when I go out um, not going to work, I rummage through my other stuff because I have so much other stuff but I don't really I'm not really drawn to anything like oh I really want to get that or I really want to use this you know depending you know most of the time when most of the time I end up when I'm not going to work still using MAC shadows which is amazing and great and I love it but I wanted to try something else and I have been eyeing this for a little bit and I, I ended up having a little bit extra money this month no birthdays <laughs> right now actually my birthday's around the corner so I can maybe call this an early birthday gift to my Myself. Um, but, um, you know, like I had a little extra money, so I figured, why don't I go for it? So I picked up the Naked 3 um, palette. Um, this is not a review on it, I'm not going to open it up. Everyone has seen these before. There's tons of videos on what the colors look like. I will do swatches when I use it, and I will post it to Instagram, and that's going to be on Crafty Scrappy Mamas on Instagram. Um, yeah, so I picked this up. I'm excited to try the skincare stuff that I picked up. I'm excited to, to see how those feel, the brushes. Um, I will be giving, like, updates on how I like these products. These are over time products, of course, and at this point, I don't have super crazy wrinkles, so the difference is going to be my new, it's probably only going to be, like, if you were in person, you could tell the difference. Definitely not like on video or maybe a very close up picture. 
Um, but I will be giving a review on what I liked about these products, if I like these products, if they got returned, what have you. Okay, talk to you guys later. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe if you haven't um, already. I know I've been doing a lot of crafting videos lately, but I still do makeup. I still post pictures of uh, my makeup looks on Instagram. So follow me on there on Crafty Scrappy Mamas. It's going to stay that way with that name only because I do more crafting updates than makeup updates even though I do even though I go to work like three days a week for Mac okay talk to you guys later hope you have a great afternoon bye